See that right there? I think that was the H and N's, and that's the best it was shooting. I got several targets set up on it, but every single thing it shot was like that. It, it had no accuracy whatsoever. But after running lead through it, this is what you know. I come up with these groups here. So run some lead through it first if you're having issues to make sure you get it broke in, and then take it from there. Alright, so fighting after uh, with this gun, I don't know, I fought with it for a good week. Um, here's what I ended up getting at 40 yards. And uh, the reason, one, uh, the JSBs I'm ranking as number one right now. It's kind of a battle back and forth between the JSB and the H&M Barracuda, but I'll show you why. Okay, once the gun started shooting for me, JSB right here. This is 40 yards. Now this is just five shots, but I'm not going to measure it. It's it's just under, right under a quarter inch. But uh, the penny is not going to stay up there. But penny pretty much almost covers it. 
Um, what's looking really good is your H&M Barracuda Hunter Extreme. Now, my Wood Flash Pup shoots these really well, too. Um, actually, my Wood Flash Pup, I shot just the JSPs through it for, uh, you know, the first nine months that I had it. And then I switched over to the Air Arms. Well, this one doesn't seem to like the Air Arms. You got one, two, three, and then these two. But this could be a dirty can. This can looks like it's not real clean. So maybe I need to clean them. Or maybe uh, uh, it needs broken in some more before it'll shoot them. I like those pellets really well. Anyway, but uh, back to the H&M Barracuda Hunter Extreme. Uh, this gun, my wood, straight out of the box, love these pellets as well. It was a favorite pellet. And it's shooting about the exact same as the JSPs. Now this is a 40 yards. Bad thing about these, once you're out past 40 yards, the your pattern really starts to um, spread out. On top of that, um, most of the time you can get a pretty good group of 40 yards with these. It just all depends. It's a you know it, it does well with them, but they're I don't recommend them anywhere past past that. Depends on if you're going to shoot them. Anyway, I did put the um, JSB King Heavies in with 33.95. Now my Wood Flash Pup loves them, uh, but this one here. What had happened? I've got a couple of shots up here at the top, right above the circle, and all my padding in here um, that I use is dropped down, and it was passing through and hitting the building. I took two or three shots right here, so I moved. I was thinking that they would drop and shoot low, and I wouldn't have to worry about it, but instead they shot higher than what the other pellets were shooting. Uh, because of the weight, I figured they would, but they didn't. So if you move these down here to this hole, that will be right here, but then there's some flyers outside. Could be me, I don't know. Um, but I'm kind of reserving those for my wood flash pup. Uh, back to the barracudas. Down here are the barracudas. If I can get it in. And, of course... You cannot see it. But down here, that was me all day. I pulled it. That was probably me too. But that old penny will cover that. I know I made a mistake with that one. But the reason I'm kind of battling between the uh, Barracudas and JSB 25.39 grain is because of this over here. This box is what I done the side end with with the Barracudas. This is a whole magazine. That's 10 shots. That was a, a complete mess up. I knew I'd done that one, so I, I don't count it. Not this time. Normally I would, but... And a penny almost pretty much just covers a ten a 9 shot group because that one there. But even, you know, outside of that, um, that's really really great accuracy it started off bad the gun didn't want to shoot good and plus I'm this gun is being put up against my hot some flash pup wood which I've now had for a couple years it's broken in and then it seems if this one follows the same patterning as my other gun the barrel is going to break in more as time goes on it's going to shoot better and better and better it just keeps getting better so that's what I've got um, if you're having issues keep slinging some lead through it I think it's going to be a really good little gun. I love the way it feels, the way it handles. I love the new bolt on it. Uh, I like the, the, the hammer. When it's turned down, it's it's really quiet. I've got it turned up now just for power, just because I wanted to see what see it run and what kind of accuracy. And this right here, you're talking these um, Barracudas, um, H&M Barracudas, that's shooting 50 foot-pound <laughs> at the muzzle. Is what uh, is what that's shooting, and that's how it's grouping with 50 foot pound at 40 yards. So great for you know, uh, you know, you could hunt pigs and hogs and stuff like that with it. I think it's going to be turn out to be a really good gun. I